Okay, so uh, here we have it, the new 5th uh, generation iPod Nano, uh, nicely boxed, sort of, uh, smooth corners running along the end, a little, little sharp along the bottom side, could do with possibly being beveled edges, I would imagine you might uh, accidentally cut, a child could accidentally cut themselves, or possibly a hamster on the edges there. No matter, it's really secondary to the thing that's inside, isn't it? So if we just, let me just peel this away. Oh, as you can see there, I think, possibly, uh, 16 gigabytes there. I don't know if it's, uh, the resolution's good enough for you to see that. Obviously there's an 8 gigabyte rare version available, but, I mean, what's the point in paying a few extra pounds for the 16 gig? So if we just take a look inside here. And there it is itself. It's almost in a kind of separate, almost hermetically sealed uh, coffin, if you like, but... Oh, hold on a second. Oh, so I've got a note in here. Handwritten note, I'll just uh, carefully place this back in its box. Put that down like so. Now what have we got here? Um, pick up the what? Um, let me have a look at this. Dear iPod Nano owner, what on God's earth gives you cause to believe that even one solitary human being on this godforsaken planet could ever possibly be a interested in watching you open a small plastic box. Purchasing a piece of electrical equipment is not an experience unique to yourself, nor is the opening of a small plastic box. Neither act requires any great skill and is therefore pointless and sad in the extreme to commit to video. Hmm. Um, if you genuinely feel that viewers of YouTube are even remotely interested in watching you open a small plastic box, then I put it to you that you must take your own life, for this is the only way for you to redeem your human soul. Pick up a gun, point it at your face, and pull the trigger. It will be painless, and the world will become a slightly better place. Do it now. Pick up the gun. Yours sincerely. The rest of humanity. Um, um, 